Do you remember where we were? Oh, that's nice. That when you load in, it lets you do a little recap. Let me see what this is. I don't need the reminder. But... Kind of. But remind me a little? Because it's okay. been a week since I, I played. I was after the secret of Monkey Island, and I decided that the easiest path to the island was to sign on to crew on the Chuck's ship. I would mount a mutiny at some convenient time. I had built myself a mop so I could get a swabby job, but I was blacklisted. They wouldn't hire me as long as I was me. Now, back to the story. That's really nice, because I do that a lot where it's like you never go back to a game because like, you don't know where the heck you were. So that's really nice that they did that. And hello, welcome back to some Return to Monkey Island. It has been a while since I've recorded this. I, I ended up um, not recording all last week. I basically, long story short, I had like a negative reaction to some medication and I was not supposed to be in recording myself and putting it on the internet. So um, <laughs> we're back. And I'm excited to play this. And the puzzle that we're stuck on now is the Bite of a Thousand Needles. And this one, I accidentally looked up. And I'm glad I did because I never would have figured it out. So the way that I accidentally looked this up was I was editing the previous ones. Um, I was editing the previous ones and I got to the point where... Um, actually, it was like this poster where I was curious how the... Any information, information oh no it's not this but um the yeah the information for the apology frog is on this poster in the plaque and i was like searching like where that information came from because it wasn't in the conversation with the governor so i was like where did it come from and i was shocked that i got those both right honestly shocked that's just steel trap memory right there but as i was searching that i was like oh the bite of a thousand needles and i was like oh i don't want to look that up and it's like i'm actually really stuck I just scroll down a little bit and then it gave it to me. <laughs> the only way that I might have figured this out is, again, when I was editing, I saw, um, I'd clicked on this. A classic specimen of Alata Needlius. Got that whole text. And then when I hovered back over it, I thought I saw something else. A classic specimen of Alata Needlius. I thought that that was what I did. Dicot known for its tasteful color. Nope, didn't want that. So that's interesting because it's. I think it's something about like. It's right with an A. I forget the name, but like um, consider like similar. Consider the stump. It was like there was a different text on it. Like think about the carnivorous plant. And I wanted to go back and check like what that text was. So maybe it's a knife thing. Gotcha. Yep. Pointy little tricky fight. So apparently that's the bite of a thousand needles. Never would have figured out. There's like thorns over there. Oh, admire the purple flowers. Was that it? Was that maybe what I saw? Cause yeah, I remember like the text change and sometimes when the text changes, it doesn't change what like the, what Guybrush does. And so you're like, why, why did the text change then? Um, so I wasn't really that curious to go back and look at it, um, but I might have, but it didn't change this time. So I definitely would have never done that. So, voodoo lady, <laughs> take this thing. This is a plant with a bad fear and enough pokey parts to back it up. Fear the carnivorous plant. All right, here you go, lady. So I'm glad there we could get go. this over with. The bite of a thousand needles. Tell me, is this an ancient, powerful charm, or simply a plant you found in the forest? Why not you were both? You're opaque about what you wanted, even for you. I took my best shot. Very well. You've always been the close enough sort. Thanks. All right, let's get some voodoo on the side patch. of deception and death drink your rejuvenation and awake sure is jiggling a lot it's nothing to worry about john laney this hapless boy no. needs your help hey take pity on him and bring him the power to hide from his enemies well you don't have to put it like that That's it? Unless you want the extended service warranty. <laughs> no thanks. I'm not a sucker. What do I owe you? Maybe try it on first, before we discuss payment. 
Am I paying with my soul? Well, how do I look? Oh. Oh, that what the heck? zombie ghost. Why look like a zombie? It's Is it what I want to look like. Does the best one can with the materials provided. I'll just wear it when I really need to. Oh, it's a nice effect. You're welcome. I think I'm ready to set sail. I'm I'm pretty sure that we're getting to the end of part one too, which is nice. And like, um, apparently the hint book would have told me exactly what to grab there, which honestly I wouldn't have hated. But yeah, that one was very very. It didn't even make sense after I had done it. Um, do I need to? Okay, you know what? Wait, yeah, is there a thing here that I need to do for the cook? Is he gonna be done at some point? Yes, yes, loom. On the table. Okay. I was while I'm passing by. No, he's still doing his thing, so I'm just gonna let him do his thing. I'm also, like, not sure that I am gonna leave, because there's still some stuff I picked up here. That, like... It's nothing. Um, like, for instance... Ooh, I could put it on. Not I actually I will put it on soon. Um, like for instance, the business card I needed to get, but this um, painting I didn't need yet. I like the dog and the sponge and the string, like all that stuff I could have not picked up. Oh, and um, I got a new trivia card. Mad monkey was the mad monkey. Oh no, I don't remember. It's so familiar. I think it was the leader of the Pirates of Danger Cove. No! But it was a monkey, wasn't it? Did it gone forever? What happens? I got this one right. But what happens? Why is it gone forever? Let's see, that's why I'm not going to answer this one until I'm sure. The ship's cat's name. Can I pick it up again? It was right here. Oh, now I'm sad. Oh, now my inventory's on the other side. Wait, can I? Open my inventory on like different sides depending on like context. No. Because I want it to open over here every time. Put it on. Once you go over and talk to the lady. I'll put, put I it on. Move farther away from the quartermaster so she doesn't see me. There. I should move farther away from the quartermaster so she doesn't see me. There? There. Hi there! You must be the quartermaster. Yep, you look like a guy without many options. I need a swabby. I am a zombie with a mop. So, show me a decent mop and the job's yours. Okay. Oh. Gotta sh How shake around a little bit. Oh, I think that might be someone I used to know. Eh, good enough. You're hired. Great. We'll be getting underway soon. Why don't you come on board and I'll introduce you to the crew. Perfect. I'm excited to see my state girl. When's a good time to discuss the benefits package? Meanwhile, at the scumbar. The Reapwood's on the Chuck's ship. He's got some kind of disguise. From the bargain bin, it looks like. So what? You don't think this could be a problem? We didn't plan for him. Mm -hmm. I hate not knowing what's going on. I should have taken him out the minute he walked in here. Don't worry, we'll know what's going on. Yeah? How? I've got a spy on board the ship. She would. And also another ship following the ship. Part two, a dangerous journey with a G and not a J. So, you know. <laughs> so once you were on LeChuck's ship, you turned the tables on them. You whipped out your sword and said, I'm your captain now. Take me to Monkey Island where you'll all walk the plank. Uh, more or less. The name's Gullin, but you're not to call me that. To you, I'm the first swab. And I want to hear the capital letters when you say it. Capital One. Got it. And this is the old. You'll be spending a lot of time down here. I thought we'd have a union or something. How much time is a lot of time? 
All of it. You work oh. here. You sleep here. You take your meals here. Forget the world you knew before. This hold is your world. It's not complicated, I ground. guess. The deck is your sky. And I have to move around too much. Deity of choice. A cruel and vengeful deity. I only okay. have one simple rule. You are not to leave this hold under any circumstances. Any questions? <laughs> Can I leave the hold? Can I leave the hold? But, no! <laughs> what happens if I leave? I said you're not to leave under any circumstances. Well, I, I know, just hypothetically. What if I did? The worst punishment you can imagine. Which is... I throw you back down here. Nothing's worse than this. <laughs> Where's my bunk? You might be all right inside one of the crates. Otherwise, be sure to cover your eyes. The chickens like to peck. But yeah, we have the ghost chickens again. If you don't sleep at all, the chickens oh, we have the... ways. We had the chickens on the ship. I don't remember if they were ghost chickens, but this seems vaguely familiar. Is it ghost chickens What's for dinner? It? We'd like a bit of dinner, would we? Well, perhaps we can arrange a bit of roast duck under glass for your majesty. <laughs> Just like any food would be but seriously, good. Seriously, learn to catch rats. Aww. You can drown them in your mop bucket. They make their own sauce. Aww. Uh, what if I need to, um, you know, mop bucket? Don't get anything on the ledge outside, though. Oh, uh, the porthole. Yeah, you're an unsightly ledge. Everyone hates an unsightly ledge. Exactly? No recruits. You're all thicker than the chickens. Uh, is that the whole answer? You're supposed to be swabbing. I want this hold sparkling, as if it was clean. Now, get away. But why? But why did you just throw that down here for me to swab? Pirate's life for me. Yar. Okay, let's look around. So I can climb to the lower deck, which I'm not gonna start with. I wonder what it's made out of. Smell the grease. I think it's chicken grease. I hope my roommates don't get upset. Swab it. No way am I picking that up with my hands. Swab it. Looks like you missed a spot. Aww. Swab it. Oi, you missed a spot. Come on. Swab it. You missed a spot. Is Swab that it. Catchphrase or something? Looks like you missed a spot. Seriously, get some new dialogue. <laughs> okay. It's I'm tempted to try that for a long time. Pamphlet that I'm supposed to carry around and read. Avoid reading the pamphlet. These are all the same. Just a bunch of rah rah stuff about I'll ships. I'll take it with me. I do love pamphlets. A new crew member pamphlet, copyright the Chuck, all rights reserved. Um, get inspired, betray trust, or transoms, commit fraud, overstay your welcome, bear false witness, destroy the beloved, destroy the beautiful, threaten bodily harm, commit bodily harm, and murder those who get in the way. Condensed from the book, The Chuck Way. Get to work, don't get fired. The ship is enchanted to be unboardable by anyone but her crew. That includes you. So don't worry about it unless you get fired, then don't worry. Then do worry. <laughs> cool. Got one of those. We More will chickens. imagine. And then we will learn. <laughs> of course it's Murray. Indeed, I am Murray, the all-powerful demonic skull. But you have me at a disadvantage with it, zombie man. Have we met before? Um, yes, it is a demonic skull. Yeah, I could see. I think oops is take off your disguise, but I want to. No, but I'm a big fan. Ah, my I'll reputation keep it going. precedes me like the locusts before the storm. Locusts? But I will sign no autographs. A curse of painful boils on your left foot for exposing me. I'm here undercover, gathering valuable oh. information for the exquisitely devious Captain Madison. Yep, Madison? that makes sense. Very interesting. She did. Ooh, she is the one who mentioned this call. Do me a favor and keep it to yourself, withered zombie man. No problem. Okay, let's keep looking around. Well, I can't see much through this thing. The rest of my gear is in there. I hope it'll be safe down here. Oh, so I don't have anything Probably in my. Fine. No, I do have things in my inventory, so I'm good. Is there anything missing? What is. 
a used something maybe? I don't have the other key anymore. So maybe I didn't have that before. Oh yeah, and the string and the poodle and the sponge and everything that I talked about is um, not there. Except for the painting, the painting's still here. It's torn and ugly, but strangely compelling. It is strangely compelling. I keep being compelled to talk about it. More importantly, is the taste of after chicken the same as the aftertaste of chicken? Fascinating. Oh. I'll keep my distance. Mothers are more vicious defending their That's young. Nice. At least they don't smell like live chickens. I'm just gonna see what I can do here. I have some chicken feed. I'm going to taste it. Uh, I don't think so. Grab it. Can I just feed the chickens? Nice chicken. Don't bite my fingers off, okay? What happens? Does anything happen? I'm gonna. I'm gonna try. Oh no! I have to grab again. Okay, let's talk to Murray. <laughs> How come you're working for Captain Madison? I thought you were your own man. Uh, Skull. I owe her a favor. It's none of your business. <laughs> Why do you owe Captain Madison a favor? Well, ironically, I was sealed up in a crate, and she freed me. Oh, you mean like I just did? It's not the same thing. What exactly is Madison up to? I would be a poor spy indeed if I told you that. You diminish us both by asking. Knock it off. You're already a poor spy. Come on. Tell me what Madison is up to. You diminish us both by asking. Knock it off. I will... Take off the eye patch. On the ship. Okay. I thought I could at least remove it in the hold. Oh, let's see what's going on up here. Going somewhere, Swabby? You haven't cleaned up that mess. Get back to Mother. I'm feeling just the slightest twinge of regret about the choices I've made up to this point. All right, can I maybe use the knife on the porthole? I was thinking, like, These to pry it open. In there. Ooh, um... No way am I picking that up with my hands. Can I pick it up? Because I can, like, swab it, but can I pick it up and use it? They're, like, wedged in there. So I'm thinking, like, can I use it to, like, loosen the screw somehow? Yep. Yes. Alright, so I can look at the screws, as I am apparently screwed. Swap the screw. Let's do them all. Why not? I think there's one down here as well. Yeah, the porthole. Swap Murray. Swap a chicken. Swap the feed. Take a break. Yep. All right. How else can I unscrew those? Where the f oh, so where's my knife? Boy, these are really wedged in there. Hmm. I mean, I have the option. Grab. Grab my horse armor. Does anyone want to see my horse armor? I've been playing a lot of Oblivion recently too, and I just got horse armor. I just, I just bought in game my horse armor for Shadowmir, and then Shadowmir disappeared, and I think it's a bug because I don't know where Shadowmir ended up. But I got him some horse armor, and I was really happy. Use this somehow. I don't know. I think it's chicken grease. I hope my roommates don't get upset. Okay, why do I have chicken grease? Right there. You come up when I say you can. Which is never. Okay. Because I will never be done mopping. You missed a spot. So now my mop's all greasy. Maybe I needed to do that first. Okay. For some reason, I thought that um I would still have the grease on my mop. I don't know. I was doing the right thing in the wrong order. Ah, we're good. That's not how we remove screw. 
Oh, examine this from the porthole. Get more. Get more. Squeeze through. It's a really tight fit. I can't quite squeeze through. All right. Come on. Tell me what man you diminish us. Ah, fine. Driving rain and crashing waves. Perfect sailing weather. All right, so now I can get out the porthole. What does that do for me? And I have the greasy screws. Can I like clean them, use them? Is there anything I can use on, like can I knife anything else? Mari, you want a knife? Okay, what well, can I, can I get something you Mari? I tried giving this to Mari already and I think we might try the business card. Nope. I try, I might try combining the screws with something. No. You may just have that with me forever. I will also add that this game is impossible to figure out where to put a face cam. <laughs> and I hate moving it around so much. There's no good spot. All right. Crackers. Soothe them with crackers. I think that only works on parrots. At least they don't smell like live chickens. All right. Let's try feeding more chickens. Cause I tried the one on the left. Still doing a thing. Well, that was fun. Look at this little patch, it's cute. Looks like you missed a spot. Oh, nuts. Swap the porthole again. Okay, now it's greasy. That felt like the obvious answer when he said he couldn't squeeze through. But I don't know. The grease helps. A little. A little? If I, if it, the answer is just more grease, I'm gonna be disappointed. You missed a spot. I know. Oh, nuts. I think I'm like looking for something more creative. Super swabby. Got an achievement. All right, so there's two states of swab. I will try to squeeze through this. I mean, you can Almost. definitely fit. The rest of my gear is in there. I hope it'll be safe down here. It's probably fine. This is interesting. Looks like you missed the spot. Thank you. Nuts. Okay. I'm gonna see if that works. Cause now there's a third state of grease. It's working. Oh, that's unpleasant. Just got birthed. Some interesting puzzles in this. This is a really cool ship though. Looks like it'd be more useful for fishing than stopping. Right? Looks a lot bigger from here. This is a bunch of empty containers of monkey bread and squid. Ah, more blah. Feast your eyes on this, me hearties. The one and only map showing the exact location. I like this guy in the corner, the little devil dude. Of Monkey Island. Flambe. The map will be kept in my cabin. No one is to touch it or disturb it in any way. Okay, well, thank you for telling me where it is. Before we can follow the map, obviously we must make our way to Monkey Island itself. Let's have the potion report. I should just follow him. 
You don't remember that from my other story? To get to Monkey Island, you Hi. have to brew a special potion. You and LeChuck had both been there before. But you and LeChuck had both been there before. Why couldn't you just sail there? No, it doesn't work like that. You have to make the potion every time. Okay. How does the potion work? I don't know. Nobody does. It's magic. It just helps you find Monkey Island. What's in it? Oh, um, let's see. Uh, it's got squid ink and monkey blood uh, and a pressed skull. I definitely remember that. Also, cinnamon, mint, and brimstone and some coloring and preservatives. Oh, and a live chicken. But listen, you shouldn't worry about this yet. Wait till you're 12 or so. Okay, I think I got it. The potion is nearly finished, Captain. All that's left is one flattened skull, and we'll be ready to cook it. Excellent. I don't remember the flattened skull. The back. New guard. Me? Hmm. You look familiar somehow. I get that a lot. Swabby conventions. Do you ever go to swabby conventions? <laughs> well, no matter. Go and get he laughed a at my skull. Joke. A flat one. Any questions? I know why we need it. Why does it have to be flat? Where should I look? Can I get a race? Sure. Straight into the rigging where you'll hang by your ankles for the next few years. Got it? Never mind. Yeah, you get used to it. Oh, apple Bob. Why do we need a skull? To finish the voodoo potion. We just went over this. Well, why does it have to be a flat skull? Because the recipe says so. Yep. Where should I look for a skull? He's not going to tell me. Yeah, I don't. I didn't feel like any of those questions were going to have satisfying answers. So let's just get to it. Meeting adjourned. Lompe, help me. And Apple Bob. I like the looks of Apple Bob too. We'll finish the potion and then I'll see about getting my hands on that map. Also, where's Gullet? Okay, potion first. Well, the potion smells like it's ready to go. It's just missing the flattened skull. How's the potion coming? You heard the captain. It's nearly finished. Go and find a flattened skull like he told you to. You can't do that. Find a regular skull and flatten it. Okay. Nice looking skull you've got there, Apple Bob. Now before you get any ideas, I'm a ghost. My skull won't work. And Putra already asked. He also has the fishing lure in his hat. Pot and see what happens. Relax, I was just making conversation. I'll find a skull someplace else. Yeah, there's a fishing lure in his hat. Oh, I can apologize. Sorry if I offended you. Oh, that's okay. I know you're under pressure. Thanks, Apple Bob. I like Apple Bob. This is a bunch of empty containers of preservatives and coloring agents. So yeah, he has the fishing lure in his hat, same as the pirate that was, um, I guess, the maitre d' at the scum bar, and also as we saw in the locksmith. in the crow's nest doing lookout stuff? Mm, the best show is down here. I want to see if you screw up this thing with this girl. Probably. Can I check the crow's nest for a skull? There's nothing you need up there. All right. Any ideas for where to find a skull? I'm really more of a watcher than a helper. Okie doke. What's it like working for LeChuck? I can't complain. Really? It's in the employee handbook. No complaint. You live longer if you remember that, new guy. Okay. Do we have a union? You should don't, Swabby. Gotta go. I'm gonna, gonna say it like that. My condolences. I like Flambe. So I don't wanna go into the ship. Ooh, cannon. Looks like it's empty. Ah. That's nice of them to let me do that. Up here. Ah, LeChuck. The very first item in the ship's safety procedures is never to try to pet Scruffles. Name of the cat. Excuse me while I check that off. Scruffles it is. I don't know if I get anything for this. Top deck schedule. One bell, crew voting. Two bells, LeChuck shouting. It's not a good time to attract attention. It's good to know that I can. Feel the warmth, feel the warmth. 
Uh, sorry to intrude your ghastliness. I told ye to find a flat. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Let me go back down now that I know what is up here. I like this, um, this decor though. Don't need the used up potion supplies. Is that a ghost? I think it's just a sculpture. I hope it's just a sculpture. End the ship! No, oh, don't let Gullet see me. These open plan offices are all the rage now. Oh, that I is a ghost guess it's a good sign if they're not trying to leave. Yeah. Oh, I barely touched it. It just fell apart. I was barely even here. I don't even know what it was. I was said I, I, Guy Brush told me that we want to do the skull before we do the sneaking into Lechuk's cabin. Stop overfeeding Molly, you rotten clods. She has digestive trouble, and I'm tired of cleaning it up. <laughs> Who's Molly? Is it this thing? Reminder to all crew. Extinguish demon fire with the proper extinguishment. Other methods will not work. What is the proper extinguishment for demon fire? You shouldn't have done that. Back through the porthole. Unless there's a skull down here. Oh wait, Murray. <laughs> Don't judge me. Show you around the ship. No. I mean, hey. Don't have to ask. Also, there's chicken poop on the crates now. I didn't go this way before. This one doesn't open. Uh, it looks like it's gonna be Lechuk's cabin, maybe. It's quite the rudder. Ooh. All right, I have a solid eight minutes. I. That's a big rudder. Apparently, there was a timer in the first game. I don't know. That's a big rudder. Sure is. Um, do I ever want to be underwater for anything? I use something with the rudder, just really quickly. Nice. All right, we'll climb back to the surface until the game's like, ah, underwater. You need to be. Big window. I think that's LeChuck's cabin, but it wasn't on the introductory tour. It's probably LeChuck's cabin. On to the surface with the skull. I don't know why I didn't think of Murray first. I can't see anything. This one doesn't open. Like we literally just have a giant skull in our room. I think I maybe I don't think of Murray as a skull sometimes. You know, I think of him as a friend more than a skull. Hello. Should I put it in the pot? Only if it's a flat one. Oh, yeah. How do I flatten Murray? How's it going in there, Murray? You will pay for this indignity, you worthless skull napper. It is mean, isn't it? Alright, how do you want to be flattened? Can I combine you with anything? No. Cannot put Murray into the cannon. Have a skull for the potion. Which is good. It's a good thing that I can't put Murray in the cannon. The crow's nest is up there. It's There's gonna let me. You need up there, okay? I mean, I guess that's nice. This is a bunch of empty containers of preservatives and coloring agents. Do you want Murray? I have a skull for the potion. I'm happy for you. How do I flatten Murray? Murray. Murray, 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 Murray. Into the ship. Can I just go over here? I wonder what's for dinner. Nope, gull is gone. Okay. I don't know if I want to brave the ship's galley. Maybe. Is there a flattening agent in here? Murray. No. That is I don't need to admire my grease trap, thank you very much. What if 
I mean, to to be fair, I don't want to flatten Murray. Just to be clear, I want him to stay alive and well and beautiful, and his, be his beautiful, sassy self. But at the same time, I want to flatten Murray. So, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Ooh, there's a this thing. Crabs like limbs, apparently. I put Murray in with the devil crabs. No, they are terrifying. made a noise the second time so I persisted. Anyone want this skull? I have a skull for the potion. Is it a flat one? Not exactly. I said a flattened skull, you useless bilge rat. Well, I don't know how to flatten Murray because I don't want to flatten Murray. <laughs> I'm going to toss him in the cauldron and see what happens. Nothing. Now I'm just doing like the run around just to click over everything and make sure that there's nothing that I missed. And then that's basically all I'm doing. I can clean up the chicken poop. So that was something. Oh, maybe? I don't think he wants to see a broken laundry machine. Oh, well, maybe you could use it to flatten his skull. Oh. Okay, I can just go in here. Wait a minute. That looks exactly like Elaine's wedding veil. Interesting. Nice. A slideshow of creepy zombie guys. It doesn't do much to cut the chill in here, but I'll take what I can get. Also feeling the warmth. Toasty. Is there nothing else that I can click on in here? That surprises I know me. Art is supposed to grab you, but this is taking it too far. the warmth feel the warmth chair there's this little nameplate feel the warmth trivia card what we got the acronym for the marley scurvy foundation is staple i very much guessed on that <laughs> Uh, take the veil. If I'm wrong about what that is, taking it would be a big mistake. If I'm right, it would be a bigger one. Ooh, I can't decide which is more disturbing. The Chuck somehow stealing Elaine's wedding veil, or him having a copy made. That's a good point. You make a lot of good points here, Guybrush. Hey, right, there doesn't seem to be anything else I can do here. Well, I have swabbed the grease without it being replaced because he's in the galley now. I mean, I could try removing my iPad. Better leave it on while I'm on the ship. <sighs> yeah. Because that would be the only way I could get into the kitchen without Gullet recognizing me. It just fell apart. I was barely even here. Can I use anything with that? Oh, can I use the screws maybe to fix it? Okay. That makes sense. And then I can use it to flatten Murray. That, there we go. That's what needed to happen. I'm with you. I'm with you, game. Let me apologize in advance. You're gonna have to take one for the team. I see no team. This is a horrible oh, way to treat Murray. Zombie man. 
He's our friend. Oh good, he doesn't know I'm Guy Rush. So I can still be friends with him after this. That's nice. I would admire your methods if they had been used on someone else. Uh, thanks, I guess. Alright, one flattened skull for the potion, and then I am done for the day. I really wanted to figure that out. I hate leaving things on a lingering issue. Hey, what are you? Next stop, Monkey Island. Bobby! Why are you out of the old? You're not ready for the deck. Where's your mom? And also. <gasps> Don't do it, Gullet. Don't ruin it for everything. Gullet, no. Alright, but that was done, so maybe we're okay? But now we'll chuck some at Gullet. Gullet was not ready for the deck. You'll be first swab now, whatever your name is. What is my name? I won't let you down. I'm just waiting for him to come down. Now it's spilled. Start making the potion again. I'll be in me cabin, gritting me collection of other people's teeth. Redo the potion? Is that even possible? No! We barely scraped together the ingredients the first time. We're out of almost everything. Let's almost. Let's the cauldron back and pretend we're working on it. Maybe he'll forget about it eventually. There's yeah, like no, so much left. Do, but it'll buy us some time. Is this one of those times where you substitute <laughs> so bored. for all the ingredients and it works yeah. anyway? It's kind of hoping. They were right. We couldn't oh. make the potion again. But you told me that you can't get to Monkey Island unless you make the potion. Well, I did. Oh, well, interim on the ground. Out, there is a way. We storytellers call what's happening now a twist. There was an important piece of the puzzle that I hadn't seen yet. I started by looking around the ship for opportunities. Hey! Is he gonna be flat the whole time? How's it going in there, Murray? I don't know what you're planning now, but I'm going to see you burn for it. I don't know what I'm planning now either. I also do want to kind of check my coin first. for incidentals. Cool. All right. That looks like a permanent stain. Yeah, smells worse than it looks. That's me for today. I'm so excited to have started part two. We're on our way to Monkey Island. This is very, very similar to the first game in how it's structured so far. So um yeah yeah we'll see where it goes from here and we'll do some puzzling on the other side so thanks again for watching and i'll see you next time bye i only have one simple rule you are not to leave this hold under any circumstances any questions can i leave the hold but no